friends with all the girls. Who are you closest to right now? Aside from my friends, uh, the Philippines are Um, I'm closest with the girls from 31 to 40 because we're always the last ones leaving every shoot. So, dahil doon, nag-bond kami. And sila yung mga una ko talagang naka-close. 31 to 40. Alright, very safe. Number ang sinabi. Yes. Okay, the next question will come from Don Terioso from the Seattle Worldwide. Hi, Don. Hello. Anyway, ang tiyan ay I think I'm just going to enjoy every moment, every activity. Yun lang. And I think I don't have any strategy. Basta, I will do my best all the time, every activity. My... Uh, I'm my own. Ako, I, ako lang yung kalaban ko dito. Whatever the girls are doing, it's myself. I'm just enjoying it. Okay. Uh, I, I consider you a veteran. Uh, Galing ka na na yung school. Yes. So, as a veteran sa mga national family, what do you think is your edge? I think my edge over the other girls is my bubbly personality. I think it will help me be closer to the people we'll be working with until the coronation. And I think it will help me um, be close to the fans. And my bubbly personality, it will help me um, do our activities and challenges this year. Everything will be light for me because of my bubbly personality. Okay. Next question from Adam Gila. Ay, Gila. Gila. <laughs> uh, hi, Danny. Um, uh, since you joined uh, environmental related pageants before, where are these environmental advocacies coming from? Is it um, from your love for the nature ever since as, as a kid? Or can you tell us where is your advocacy stemming from? Um, ever since I was a kid, my parents um, lagi kami dinadala on beach trips and nature hikes. So I think dun ang galing yun. And mas lalo siyang nag-ignite when I joined Miss Cuba Philippines. When I saw the plastic damage and the uh, pollution is going underwater. So I think dun ang galing, nag-ignite like, yung pinaka-passion ko. That's why I ended up um, joining Miss Philippines Earth para mas malaki yung platform for my environmental advocacy. But right now, with Minimini Filipinas, I am straying away from that. I will be highlighting um, the children. I want to empower them and inspire them to become somebody when they grow up. So how do you, um, through what? Through, um, through arts. Through because arts. As we all know, to, to na open, na ignite yung passion ng kids. Especially role playing. Oh, ano, let's play like doctor style or they, they role play as teachers. Diba? Doon nag-ignite yung passion nila. Ay, paglaki ko, gusto kong maging teacher, gusto kong maging doctor, gusto kong maging police. So, because of arts, children will be able to be play, play around characters whoever they want to be make. So, your course mo in college was related to that? Is yes, I'm a theater cabin from ah. college. That inspired me. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. I see. Ah, kaya role playing. Yes, yes, yes. And also, kasi po, um, last year, after the earthquake, a huge earthquake struck uh, the Mindanao region, um, the Mindanao region, I was sent to Mindanao Beach Cabin to a stress debriefing art caravan for the kids, for the victims. So yun, um, may namin po akong puppeteer and I asked him, I did, ito po lang muna, nakita ko po kung paano niya um, na-engage yung kids and yung parents sa puppet show niya. So uh -huh. I think, mas okay na na platform yun, yung puppeteering para ma- ma-, ma Yes, yes po. Para ma-share ko yung advocacy ko sa kids and also their parents. Kasi di ba, if hindi supportahan ng parents yung kids sa kids, paano? Okay, thank you. Thank you. Okay, next question from Mr. Robert for Katrina of Manila Politics. Hi, Nadia. Who are your idols and who are the people you look up? I look up to, of course, Ate Catriona Gray because I think Ni level up yung 
Miss Universe, yung fashion industry. And I think totoo yung sinabi niya sa Miss Universe stage na na yung isang kid, she, she can't dream to be somebody else because yung sinasabi ng parents niya, hindi natin kaya yan. We can't afford to send you to this school or parang di, na, di ka namin kaya um, i-push para ma maabot yung pangarap mo. Ganun. So I want kids especially in the rural, rural areas, to be inspired to become somebody when they grow up. Parang hindi lang sila dun sa life na kinalakihan nila based on their parents. Have you met her? Um, I met her in an event, not yet po po. I'm hoping kasi um, yung puppeteer trainer ko, na-meet na siya. And ayun, sana magkaroon ng day para mag-meet kami personally. Okay. Okay, next question from Tita Lavinia of Tita's of Pageantry. <laughs> Hi, Hi, Danny. So, recently, um, na feature yung photos ng Binibini, and one of the favorite photos was your photo. Um, na connect nila lahat yun sa K drama, kasi kamukha mo yung isa sa mga lead stars na crash landing on you. Um, actually, it was a really, really good comparison, kasi tumaas lalo yung buzz sa name mo. How did you feel about this? Um, serendipitous ba? Or talagang yun yung yun yung focus nyo when it came to styling? Um, hindi po. I think seren tama yung term nyo po. Serendipitous lang. And hindi po kasi ako nanonood ng TV. So, hindi ko alam yung sinasabi na lang crash landing on you. And sa tingin ko, nagkikwala po ko sa destiny. Everything's lining up. Hindi ko naman sinasadyo maging kahawig yung girl dun sa k-drama na crash landing on you. But yun, tumama siya. <laughs> And then, um, if I may, there's another um, commenter on Tita sa pageantry. Her name is Babsikil. Ang tinatanong niya, ano yung magiging technique mo para mag-shine ka sa coronation, lalo na may mga obvious na frontrunners na talagang matunog na yung pangalan? I, I think I will just continue to be me about the candidate. I think that's really my edge over the other girls. Funny. Oh, okay. Thank you so Thank you. much. Okay. Ayan, Babsikil. Uh, <laughs> the next question is from Daniel Gray of uh, Fifty Shades Darker. <laughs> Fifty Shades Darker. <laughs> Fifty Sizes Children Empowerment through Arts. I, I know it's a very broad advocacy, mm. pero um, I want it to be concentrated on um, theater performance. <laughs> And because I think because of role playing, children will they will play around roles of what they want to be when they grow up. So this is the Um I don't know how you a doctor po. <laughs> five seven, but according to Bini Bini, I'm five five. So I'm a theater gathering po from Miriam College, Batch 2014. Okay, so the next question is from Tristan Francisco, Philippine Pageantry. First, I would like to commend you for your personality because that's what I remember when I inter when we interviewed you during the final screening. Kanina, when I was deciding if I should go, sabi ko, sino ba si Danica? I checked. And then, oh, siya yung hindi cliche sumagot. <laughs> Thank you. So, I so, so awesome. you have mentioned that your um, your advocacy is about environment and then you're going to use your theater uh, experience to to gather information, or uh, rather, uh, gather attraction and attention to your advocacy. Now, um, looking at you now in this different angle and then with your different hairstyle now, kasi nakalugay ka noon sa ano eh, um, parang meron kang charisma like Mukiada Tulu. Oh my! Thank you! Oh, so, yung charisma, and that charisma won for her the title of the Supranational. Now, the question is, ano sa available titles ang kino-target mo talaga? Of course, I'm aiming for the highest title po. Which but is of course, internet. whatever Binibini gives to me, I will gladly accept it and I will do my best to represent the country in the international, international stage. And hopefully, I get to bring an international crown. You, it seems that you might. Now, uh, my, uh, my second question is, today's the uh, International Women's Day. 
Uh, hindi ba masyado ng uh, gamit yung equality or gender equality for women? Ngayon nga, ano na yun? Ano, bago na yung hashtag eh. What was the ha- what's the hashtag now? Um, parang equality for all or something like that. So yung women empowerment na to, kailangan pa ba ng women empowerment at this time, lalo na ngayon may sarili ng platform ng mga kababaihan katulad nyo? Because recently there's this viral photo that was that uh, that that was posted on Facebook about this woman na entitled siya na feeling it feeling entitled na kailangan pa upuin siya sa bus. And then the guy explained on his own post na he worked the whole day, he's tired and everything. Nagsusorry siya hindi siya napaupo. So how do you feel na may mga babaeng ganun? I think, iba-iba po kasi tayo. Pero I think, uh, importante pa rin po yung women empowerment. Because yung mga kababaihan, sila po yung nanganganak eh. So sila yung mas may, may edge, may power over... Let me that. I think we should empower women because they are more caring and nurturing people. Pero of course, hindi naman po natin kailangan um, masyado ipaba i- yung men because they also do their things. So, yun. Okay, thank you. Okay, and there's a black. Next question, Mr. J. Pacao from Malaya. This is Elisa. Anyone? Yes. Why is Why is Because it is my mother's hometown. And we don't have a lot of people in So I want to um, boost their tourism. And I love my mom's hometown. It's really beautiful. Sorry, Where would you bring me? I'm sure I Sa Bonbon Beach po, kasi yun yung pinakasikat namin beach dun sa Roblon because of the uh, sandbar. Sandbar? Sandbar? The beach is nila itong parang ng Bulacan. Sorry? Opo, opo. Yun kasi, um, yung Roblon, very undis- undiscovered pa siya actually. Hindi pa siya masyado developed. So, if you want to find peace and still be in a beautiful beach, I invite you to go for Ah, <laughs> uh, yes po. I get to dive every now and then. Ah, uh, yesterday. I went diving to shoot my uh, tourism video for the press presentation of the Philippine. Uh, hi. Yeah, you said that you, you're a graduate of theater arts. So, usually yung mga linya ng mga theater arts, di ba? Usually plays, actresses, stage stage actors, showbiz. So, yeah, production. Pero, why join a beauty contest? So, parang, although medyo pareho naman yung trajectory, I mean, medyo okay naman yung trajectory, pero was it, what is, what is it about beauty pageants that is attracting you more than pursue a stage or showbiz career? Can I be honest? <laughs> of course, of Actually, course. Actually, I, I, I didn't think that I'd become a beauty queen. Nung bata lang kasi ako, gusto ko maging beauty queen. Kasi nakita ko sila sa TV eh. But when I entered school, parang every, pag tinatanong ko ng parents ko, pabago-bago na yung sagot ko. And then, the reason why I joined the pageant, because um, yung first pageant ko was Miss Cuba Philippines. So sabi nila, I get to do, I get to learn free scuba diving. So, yun po, kaya ako nag-join ng, ng budget because of free scuba diving kasi mahal siya. And yun, sa scuba diving, um, I get to do it for free. And then, um, I love the uh, the budget advocacy. So, nag-tuloy-tuloy po ako sa Miss Philippines Earth to, for a bigger stage for my environmental advocacy. And then, nag-tuloy-tuloy po ako ng Pilipining Pilipinas kasi na-try ko na yung budget so which is more cutthroat for you in terms of discipline mm-hmm. The uh, it was the pageant industry or the one in in theater. I think it's theater. 
theater pa rin. Theater pa rin. I see. Okay. Okay, we're down to our last few questions before the next batch of raffle. This is from Ferdy and Bihar from different colleges. Pwede mo ba ko sumali sa raffle? Hindi mo na po. 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 Actually, hindi pa po. Pero last January, when I went home for our um, festival, Kiniraya Festival, kinausap ko na po yung mayor and governor namin asking for their support para sa um, next budget na sasalitan ko. Hmm? Because uh, I carry wrong blood ever since I started doing budget. So, yun. Sana this time, mas mas solid yung support na ng wrong blood sa akin. Yun lang naman yung hinihingi ko sa akin. Are you planning to go try out your Yes, of course. Holy week po dapat, pero mukhang mababaano kasi we'll be having a break because of the uh, uh, virus. So yun, magkaka-break po kami and I will um, gagamitin po yung time na yun para umuwi sa room. You mentioned how I had to let your shitty your recent video or something. Hindi ba dapat room na ako room na? As much as possible, ganun po dapat. But because of the deadline that they're giving us, I think I just focus on my advocacy. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, so now do the raffle. My message is that Danny would like you to give your final message to everyone so that you can also gather their support as well as the fans and followers. Okay, you can do it now. Hello, everyone. I'm Bini Bini32, asking for your support sa Bini Bini journey ko. I hope you support me and the other girls sa journey namin. So, thank you! On the lighter side, may ano, love light pa si Dan. <laughs> Ay, wala po. Focus tayo sa career. <laughs> On the lighter side, love 